Here's Little Timmy. Little Timmy is an average American human male. However, the world that Little Timmy lives in has been infected by... Zombie Menace! He needs to know how to stay safe. We interrupt this regularly scheduled program to bring you signs your roommate might be a zombie. Does your roommate have a dispensation to wearing his bandana around his head or neck? Does your roommate know your daily schedule as well as the schedule of others? Does your roommate have an insatiable craving for living flesh? Does your roommate only say brains? These may all be signs that your roommate is part of the zombie menace. If you see one or more of these signs in your roommate or in anyone else, get to the nearest safe zone and await further instructions. But what if Timmy needs to go outside? Don't worry, there are a few simple and easy ways little Timmy can protect himself. Let us go to the lab of renowned foam weapons expert, Professor Pfeiffer. Hi there, I'm Professor Pfeiffer. Now, as you know, your standard strong arm is a six-shot revolver. Remember simply cock, aim, and fire. Remember, no modifications are allowed to your, so to your personal weapon. Now take a look at our newest development. We here at the lab have to call them Standard Oxidized Cotton Kinetic Strikers, or SOCKS for short. This top secret weapon can be made from your average household materials and is just as effective as a blaster in combat. Simply bundle, like such, aim, and throw. And the zombie is stunned! Remember, the only good zombie is a stun zombie. Here is an average American human female, enjoying some time in the sun. Better watch out! Oh no! A zombie! Those are some tough cookies. Our average human female is now a feast for the horde. Remember, one human kill resets three zombie star timers, so be careful. The only thing worse than Zed is dead. Details can get a little sketchy in a world plagued by... Zombie Menace! So if it is hard to tell which came first, a tag, or a stun, a duel will determine the winner. First, Little Timmy gets his choice of weapons. Either one blaster, with one bullet, or two S-O-C-Ks. Little Timmy will then face his personal Zombie Menace. With a little skill, a good duel will begin to look something like this. Remember, that zombie is only done for 10 seconds, so it looks like our sheriff should be the one running. Here's a map of the infected areas of the city. Areas in green are safe zones. They have been treated with special disinfectant, so zombies cannot tag or be stunned inside them. But beware, all of the areas in red are fair game. Be alert. Carry your weapons when you are in these areas, and remember, when you leave the infected area, be sure to remove your armband to avoid scaring innocent civilians. So, little Timmy, what have we learned? Dude, wear your bandana. Don't be rude to your fellow humans or zombies. 
do smile. You only have one apocalypse, so enjoy it. Now I know. Now I know. Now I know. How to fight the zombie horde.